this is how to play um this is um how to play sims to pets for um the ds or dsi this again is not sims 2 this is sims 2 pets i just forgot to write in the um pets and the little sign there i apologize for that but i forgot to and again it's for the ds or the dsi i just have a picture of a dsi because that's the system i have okay first step is to you have your dsi here or ds and um, you just hold it and then you um, simply turn it to the back. See the little slot there? You take your Sims 2 Pets game. You may or not be able to see that. Actually, I'm going to turn off the lights because you can't really see it like when I turn on the DS. It's going to be kind of hard to see it. But then again, I have like um, a little lamp in here, so it makes it easy to see too. So then you open up your system. You press the power button that's located here. The power button. Yeah, the power button. I'm sorry, I apologize power button is located here then it's kind of bright but I turned off the light so you might be able to hear see better I mean and then you take your finger or your stylus and just tap the screen to um or press a button or something and then you um insert your game like so Then you press the start button once you see where it is. You scroll. Do you click? You could you could have tapped on it, but I clicked. Then you choose at this point which language. I'm gonna do it in English because that's what English. I mean that's the language I speak. But if you speak a different language or multi language, you could click a different language. I already have people on here, so I'm just gonna um Actually I think I'm gonna start a new game so that way you guys can get the full effect. So you will click new game. And then you would fill out this personal test. See, it's a little checklist. I don't, you may or may not be able to see it. But I'm going to read off the checklist of the things you do. First, number one, fill out the personal info. Two, create a new outfit. Three, pick up a new pet. Four, move into your house. And um, five, treat a, your first patient. And in this um, sim, you just happen to be a doctor. You have to be a doctor in this game. Then you click the little arrow. It's a little arrow you may or may not be able to see here. I'm going to try to zoom in the best I can. Again, I apologize for the lighting. It's kind of blah in here. Anyway, so you can change your gender. Right, I'm going to keep mine female because, I, again, I'm a girl, so I'm going to go keep mine female. And then you will click change your name because... Well, you don't want it to be Dr. Sim sign because that's the name they pick. So then, from this point, you would type in, you would backspace. I'm going to backspace by clicking the backspace button all the way. And then you would type in the name you want yours to be Dr. And then you put on the name. I'm going to make mine be Dr. Um... Dr. Nani. And then there's also different ones you can write it in different languages. So mine is Dr. Nani. 
Then you will click the arrow again that I showed you before. So we're gonna click that arrow. Then next you're gonna create your outfit. Your um from this point you would just pick the outfit that you want. I'm just gonna pick the outfit real fast. Just um I'm just gonna pick any old outfit. And then you can also pick the length of the outfits and all. Um, I'm just going to pick something very simple and quick just so we don't take forever. Because I hate when people make videos and they take forever to pick an outfit and stuff. So then I'm just going to hurry up and pick something. Okay, so this is the outfit I picked really fast. The outfit I picked really fast. Pretty good outfit for rushing. Then next you would pick the um. Next you would pick your pet. Like here is the pet they start you off with. Then you click the continue. And then you would pick the breed. Like you would click here to change the breeds. And then up there the breed changes. And then you keep clicking so you get one that you like. And also you can click, and those are the dogs, but you can click the cat and you can have a cat. Um, so they have exotic, um, a whole bunch of different types of cats. Just to show you a few. I'm just going to pick this cat again. I'm just trying to show you how to play so I'm not really taking my time to pick if I was picking by myself then now you can change your pet's name to here you would um same thing you did for your sims character but you would um backspace your character's name I, I mean the dog's name and then you can name it anything you want I'm just gonna name it Max I'm just gonna name it Max because it's an easy name and again, like I said, I'm rushing. And then in here you can choose if it looks more like your more like the mom or the more like the dad. Okay, and then like you can change the furs and all that junk. I'm just gonna leave it right I'm gonna leave it right there. Or I'm gonna leave it right there just you know because I'm rushing. Rushing. Then you can um adjust your fur. Do you want your fur to look like the mom or the dad? Here you can adjust the fur to look like the mom or the dad. I'm just going to pick this just to hurry up because I don't want people to say she's taking forever because like the last person who made the video did. Um, you can then you can adjust how big you want the head, how big you want the rear, meaning the butt, and how big you want the tail to look and I'm just gonna leave it how they did and but you can adjust that yourself since um, you're watching when you um, start playing and then next you m click the arrow to move into your house and then it moves you into your new house the doorbell rings and then a whole bunch of stuff pops up for you to read you can read that on your own time like it just basically Okay, I'm going to read it for you. My sim says, oh, my very first morning in my new home. And way, and the way, the very first day of my new job too. I wonder how I'll do. I'll best freshen up first. And I better hurry too. I think that's my first customer waiting and then here this shows you this tells you how you're playing I'm gonna zoom in it's sorry it looks a little bit backward because you know it's kinda got that little mirror thing you know how it looks in the Eggerton mirror but you might if you can read backwards try to read that but if you can't I'll read this I'm reading the same thing I just showed you I'm gonna read this cuz it's hard for you to see use the um this button here control pad to move the ca camera view 
Use Y buttons Y and A buttons to rotate the camera view. Use the X and B buttons to zoom in the camera view. Use the L button and the center camera view to the dot. That's kind of confusing, but I'll explain. And then, pretty much shows you how to do everything. That's just one thing, like basically, but I'm going to walk through that anyway. And then, like, you can um, move around your house and stuff. You just click on the bed if you want to sleep. And again, on this game, you can't have kids or a husband. You just be a doctor. So I think sucks. And you can pick sleep, nap, uh, sleep to tomorrow. You can shower. Oh, I'm going to show you guys how to um, cook. To cook, you would click on the stove. You would click cook. And then, like, you can cook food like this. You can actually cook it, which is one of the reasons why I think the game is unique. And you, like, toss it around and stuff and start cooking. And then you click check. And then I kind of rush through that, but she'll tell you if she likes it or not. She starts eating. So that means I didn't, she did not die. She just passed out because it was gross. Yeah, I cook very gross food. And you get to, um, also you get to, um, check out the customers. You can exam, you're, um, veterinarian on this game. So I'm going to show you how to treat the pets. How do you, um, like, treat them and stuff. You would, um, so let's treat the pet. It says hello. She's saying she's talking to the customer. It says hello again. Sorry, you, can't, you might not be able to see this that much. How are you? She's saying awesome. You're really um, certified. Sorry, I hope you can see this, but it's kind of hard to see. Sorry, because I'm shooting from a webcam, so it makes it kind of hard to video. Um, my dog smells. It's what I have here. So when the dog smells, you would take them in, you would hold them in, and you would um, clean them and stuff in the bathtub. But this is basically how you take care of the pet. You would um, use a stethoscope like this. And that basically checks and stuff. And then you would, uh, you can also um, rub them like this. Then you could um, also brush. When you use the brush, that's checking for fleas. You brush, you keep brushing until you, the test is finished. And then you could feed them foods. In case that's the case, the owner didn't feed them. Some on his dump, and then he eats it. So then you would save the game. That's the basic how to play. And then, well, hope you enjoyed that. And um, again, this is how to play The Sims 2 Pets for the DSi. Hope you enjoyed that. Please comment, post, subscribe, and um, put whatever you feel in the comments. I won't take offense. And um, tell people about it. And if you didn't like this, watch some of my other videos. You might like those better.